Okay, so let's say you've got this Word document, or maybe even a PowerPoint presentation, or an Excel spreadsheet, and you deleted it. Or maybe you changed the file a couple of times, hopefully for the better. Or maybe you did something else that when you really think back on it, maybe that wasn't necessarily your best move. If you've done this or other things and you need to retrieve a file, then let me introduce you to the recycle bin and version history in Microsoft's OneDrive. They are really easy to use. They're real lifesavers. And like most Microsoft products, there's multiple ways to get there. Version history and the recycle bin let you retrieve documents that you've changed or deleted. You can even get files back from a long time ago. So if you've wondered what that whole auto save button up there is really doing, then stick around and let me show you how to use and control version history and the recycle bin in Microsoft's OneDrive. Oh, and OneDrive for Business. OneDrive version history works in the background. So all you'll need to do to get started is to save the file to any OneDrive folder location. Once the file is saved, autosave will activate in the top left corner of the window and the file is automatically saved You can control autosave and version history by going to the options of the Office program. And then from the Save menu on the left, selecting one of several features, including the Save Interval, the location, and whether autosave will save a version of the file, even if you close without saving. After the initial save, any changes to the file are saved into version history. You can access version history by moving to the File tab. Once at the File tab, just navigate to the Info section, and then over and down to Version History. Once you select Version History, a pane will open on the right side of the application, and you can select from Previous Versions. You can also access version history by selecting it from the title bar at the top of the application, where you can also save the file. The version history will open on the pane on the right, and you can select previous versions to restore or view. You can also access version history in OneDrive by viewing your OneDrive folder online. Just right click choose View Online, and when the online view opens, just navigate to your folder, and then either right click or select the three dot next to a file and choose Version History from the bottom of the list. This will show all previous versions numbered and you can access any of those versions simply by clicking on the number. This will open the file in its native application so you can either save as or save over an existing file. Now I mentioned that one important part of version history is the recycle bin. And in this case, I'm going to delete my important document. And to retrieve that document at some point in the future, if I'm in OneDrive online, I can just click the recycle bin and restore my document 
which has now been saved in OneDrive's recycle bin. And the file is restored. So that's how to use and control the recycle bin and version history in Microsoft's OneDrive. So if you're still storing your files on the desktop, stop storing your files on the desktop and take advantage of the restoration features in Microsoft's OneDrive. Oh, and OneDrive for Business. So until our next video, thanks for joining me and I'm Wayne.